I'm Natalia Averett. I go by Natty. I'm the UUA trustee for the Joseph Priestley District, and I'm going to talk a little bit about what the UUA board is doing to promote multiculturalism, anti-racism, and anti-oppression in the UUA and within our congregations. Because the UUA board is mostly a direction setting entity, most of our work that directs the work of the UUA staff comes through policy and our main policies are the ends for the association and they are the primary goals that the president is focusing on when directing the association's work and three of our goals are related to multiculturalism and inclusion and anti-oppression and they read that we want our congregations to be intentionally multi-generational and multicultural embracing and struggling with issues of oppression and privilege and open and inclusive in their outreach and welcome and throughout the year we spend time with the leadership um, staff as well as the president and others within the association getting reports on what's going on finding out about new programs and making sure that these goals are really being put into practice and turned into programs that our congregations and the people outside of our congregations who are served by the Unitarian Universalist Association are really making use of and actually making sure we're getting some results. On the internal level, the board focuses on its own multicultural awareness, its own multicultural and multi-generational composition, and our own ability to deal with issues of oppression and privilege. And we make sure that in each board meeting, all of our committees and work groups are doing process observations and responding to whatever comes out of process observations, that we um, participate in ongoing training, and also that the board's committees that appoint people as well as the work we do with the nominating committee focuses on making sure that nobody is in a leadership position who hasn't received any sort of training and then also at the highest levels of the association that we continue with periodic training and at the board level we do it at every single in-person meeting because we know that it is a constant challenge to keep expanding our own understanding of our role in the association as well as the broader world. And we hope that other congregations, other Unitarian Universalists will find whatever way they can to help promote these goals of multiculturalism, inclusion, multi-generationalism, anti-racism, and anti-oppressive practices so that we can all support each other at all levels. And I'm really sorry that I cannot be with you all, but I really am so pleased at all the work that you do and the commitment that you show.